In this lecture, we will learn about modifying XML using Python. Let's say we wanted to change the store element to a shop element, just using Python code, not modifying the XML string. How would we go about doing that? Actually, Python makes it quite easy. For this example, we would just change the roots tag to shop. Then we can print out root.tag. When we run the code, you will notice that shop was printed out, demonstrating that our code successfully changed store to shop. We can also use Python code to add an element to the XML tree. For example, let's create a variable named new element and set it equal to xml.etree.elementTree and use the subElement function. This function takes in two arguments. The first is the parent element for the new element. The second is the name of the new element. For example, the parent of our new element is root and the name is item. Then we will set the attribute of the new element to have a key of category and a value of shield. To see the result of the code we just typed, we can use a for loop. For child in root, we will print out the tag and attribute of the child. When we run the code, you will notice that our element is item and it has a category attribute with a value of shield. To remove an element from the XML tree, we can use the remove function. For example, let's type root.remove and pass in new element. Then we will iterate over each child in root and print out the child's tag and attribute. When we run the code, you will notice that the weapon and spell exist, but the shield was removed from the XML tree based on the code that we wrote. In the next lecture, we will look at a recap of what we learned in this section of the course.